Shabbat Shalom, good Shabbos. This has been a very difficult week for us as we've watched violence spread across Israel. It is difficult for us to watch here in the United States and have a feeling of helplessness, feeling of frustration, tremendous grief. We hope that this Shabbat will bring more peace to the region, that we'll all be able to find some Shalom. We have some special music tonight to help us focus on peace to help us think about Israel and to remain positive in a dark time. But this is also time for celebration in our community. We have a chance to celebrate with a bar mitzvah and we're very excited for the Beagle family and for Noah in particular who's celebrating in bar mitzvah this week. We have a lot of great things to look forward to. Looking forward to seeing people in person more and more. We had an Israel rally this week to bring the whole community together we hope you find some peace this Shabbat. We're going to show you some photos of that rally in a little bit. But most importantly, may this Shabbat bring peace to our community, to Israel, indeed to the entire world. Good Shabbos. Kol haolam kulo, gesher tsar me'od. The whole world is a narrow bridge. But the most important thing is to be unafraid. Especially now, we want to remind everyone not to panic, to be hopeful, to be unafraid, to know that you are needed and loved in this world. Kol haolam kulo, gesher tsar me'od, gesher tsar me'od, gesher tsar me'od. Kol haolam kulo, gesher tsar me'od, gesher tsar me'od. Ve'ha'ikar, ve'ha'ikar, lo lefachet, lo lefachet klahal. Ve'ha'ikar, ha'ikar, lo lefachet klahal. Lai 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 la lai 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 Gesher tsar me'od, kol haolam kulo. Gesher tsar me'od, gesher tsar me'od. Ve ha'ikar, ha'ikar, lo lefachet, lo lefachet klahal ve ha'ikar, ve ha'ikar.
Come, let us greet the bride, the Kala, the Chadodi, the beautiful song of Kabbalat Shabbat. <laughs> As we say the blessing over the Shabbat candles and bring Shabbos into our lives. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Asher Kitshano Bemitzvotav Betsihivanu Lehad Likner Lehad Likner Shel Shabbat Lehad Likner Lehad Likner Shel Shabbat Amen As we say Baruchu, praise God, the source of all blessing, we are called together just as our ancestors were in prayer together. Lai la 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 Baruch Adonai HaMivorach HaMivorach Le'oholam Va'ed HaMivorach HaMivorach Le'oholam Va'ed Baruch Ha'am Vorach Le'olam Va'ed
We love God with all our heart, with all our soul, with all our being, as we focus our energy, our kavanah, on that oneness. We say Shema. Yeshima Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad We'll stand up now and be recognized for all that you've done we'll Get up now Yisrael The Lord God is one It's easy or not to do all that God has asked But you're who you are and by that grace you're all like the rest. To them I say there's joy in who you are. Stand up now and say Shema. Yes, I am. Shake the hand of everyone you meet But don't forget who you are A people so unique A shimmer than himself to you Set your people free If that was all it done It'd be enough But she stayed with you and me And so she might It's like What does redemption mean to us? Freedom, liberty. For thousands of years, the Jewish people have upheld a vision of a world redeemed. Our redemption at the Sea of Reeds is celebrated every day. The words Michamocha. Oh, 
Kibenu Adonai, lay us down, God, in peace. Protect us, keep us safe from war, from illness, from strife. Shelter us beneath your wings of peace. Sukkot Shalom Echa. Spread out the shelter over us. God us and love. Shield us from the soul that swings our way. In the shelter in the shadow. Oh 
Haski Venu Arona Eloheinu El Shalom Nahamidenu Shomreinu Lechaim Lay us down, Lord Lay us down Down Hashki Venu Adonai Elohim Lel Shalom Hamidenu Shomreinu Lechaim Hashki Venu Adonai Elohim Lel Shalom We pray for life, Lord, we pray for peace. Now and when the drums are at ease, and blessed well, is the one who gave us bread. Yeah, you saved us so we can live what we've got left. Shamru reminds us that Shabbat is truly a gift. Throughout the generations, the Jewish people have treasured Shabbos, have seen it for the potential to renew, to restore, to give us a sense of Shalom.
How do we create peace in our world, maintain harmony? We ask for God's help, as the Amidah concludes with the prayers for peace. Oh, says Shalom, Shalom bim Ramav, Hu 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 yase, hu yase Shalom, Oh, says Shalom, Shalom bim Ramav, Hu 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 yase, hu yase Shalom. Who yase shalom, shalom aleinu, ve'ako Yisrael, ve'imru amen, ve'ako Yisrael, ve'imru Amen. Oh, say shalom, shalom bim romav. Who, who, yase, who, yase, shalom. Oh, say 
יעשה שלום, שלום במרומיו, הוא, הוא יעשה, הוא יעשה שלום, הוא יעשה שלום, שלום עלינו, ועל כל ישראל, ואמרו אמן, ועל שלום, שלום במרומיו, הוא יעשה, הוא יעשה שלום. או, עושה שלום, שלום במרומיו, הוא יעשה, הוא יעשה שלום. הוא יעשה שלום, שלום עלינו, ויעל כה ישראל, ואמרו אמן. Dear God of our ancestors, help us renew our faith, help us renew our faith, grant us a perfect healing, bring peace to all our days, bring peace to all our days. El Nair Rufan Allah Rufan Allah El Nair Rufan Allah Rufan Allah Restore our strength of body Help clarify our minds, help clarify our minds, refresh our time and spirits, refresh our time and spirits, rejuvenate our light, rejuvenate our light. blessings throughout our days and nights throughout our days and nights we celebrate the journey celebrate the journey this precious gift of life this precious gift of life
This week, Temple Beth and me organized a community-wide rally to show our support with Israel. Yesterday, we gathered at City Hall, had a chance to bring together members of our community from all backgrounds. But we had the rabbis from the congregation speak. We also had our own Rob Hershenson, who spoke about his experiences as a volunteer for Israel in Sarel back in 2014, during the last time that Israel suffered through a barrage of hundreds of missiles and rockets. We had a chance to uh, be together, even though it was for a, a very difficult situation, at least it brought our community together. So as we go ahead and again, think about what we can do in the coming days, I want to encourage everyone to stay informed, to be informed, to learn what's going on and make sure you have the full story. It's very hard sometimes because the media will pick and choose what narrative they want to share, but please try to bring together the information. It's also very important for Israel not to become a wedge issue. So I encourage people from all political backgrounds and across the spectrum to join together on this issue. Those on the right, please don't gloat when the current administration may make a false step. Let's encourage as a unified country. Those on the left, it's sometimes hard, but be courageous and don't forget those leadership members of our administration and of Congress are there supporting Israel at the very top. We hope that will continue and that again, this won't be a situation for people to have to choose sides when they want to support Israel. And for our young people and for all of us really to be courageous when we are watching and participating in discussions on social media. It's very hard because some of the discussions turn quite anti-Semitic and uh, it's difficult. We want people to continue to be positive and that's the last thing. Keep praying, keep hoping, keep imagining a Middle East at peace. We know it's possible. We know that different sides can come together against all odds and we pray that that will happen, that shalom will come to the region. So this weekend, as we hopefully find a sense of shalom, we also share this song for peace.
take yourself out of the center of that life for just a moment. Your gift is to care for someone else. Your gift is to love someone else. Your gift is to make someone else's life a little better in any way you can. And if you follow that principle, if you let that be the light that you follow through this world, you will know God in a beautiful and powerful way. So dig deep, find your voice. Ojavo shalom aleinu ve'al kulam. Ojavo shalom aleinu. Ojavo shalom aleinu. Ojavo shalom aleinu ve'al kulam. Ojavo shalom aleinu. Ojavo shalom. Tonight at Temple Beth Ami, we remember the yard sites, the losses at this time of year. Philip Thaw, Nettie Berkson, Vernon Wolf, Hirsch Skura, Alan Fleischman, Alma Levinson, Ray Stein, Maura Schwartz, Stanford Monheim, Lewis Kaplan, Al Ponce, Lynn Suffin, Hortense Ellen, LeGrand Vricking, Kevin Brill, Myrna Reeder, Dave Blazer, Jeanette Levy. And we remember during this last Shana, during this last year, Helen Horn, Susie Wolf. Bernice Sherman, Mark Berman, Phil Blazer, Shirley Carb, Mae Goodson, Helen Larner, Harvey Hasen, Linda Olis, Bud Schaefer, Victoria Rothschild, Muriel Reese, Rose Miller, Philip Sakratov, David Watson. May they be remembered for blessing. Yit gadal v'yit gadash shemei rabah. V'yalma divrach irutei v'yamlich malchutei. Bechayechon of Yomechon of Chayedecho Beit Yisrael, Bagalau Vizman Kari Vimuru, Amen. Yehe Shme Rabba Mavarach, Leolam Ulamel Maya. Yit Barach, Vietabach, Viet Paar, Viet Ramam, Viet Nase, Viet Adar, Viet Ale, Viet Alau Shme de Kudisha, Riahu. Le Elam in Kobirchata Veshirata, Tushbechata Venechemata, Damiran Vialma Vimuru. Amen. Yehe Shlomo Rabba Min Shemaya, Bechaim Alenu Vial Ko Yisrael Vimuru, Amen. O Se Shalom Bim Romav, Huya Se Shalom, Alenu Vial Ko Yisrael Vimuru, Amen. May the source of peace send peace to all who mourn and comfort to all who are bereaved, and let us say, Amen. The Jewish people are connected to each other and to our homeland to the ancient land and the future land. Eretz Yisrael, Hatikva, the hope, the national anthem of our people. Sophia, Odlo of the Tikva. 
Good job. Thank you for spending some of Shabbat with us. And we are very excited that this Shabbat we celebrate with a member of our community, Noah Beagle, as he celebrates Bar Mitzvah. And so we are supporting him, there for him and his family, as he uh, has one of the first events that we have in our synagogue after this uh, lockdown. We have brand new carpeting, brand new cameras that are installed in the synagogue. And you're going to be able to see events streamed from Temple Beth Ami very soon. We also, of course, have the next week classes online, Tuesday, 9 a.m., our Midrash class, chance for us to read the uh, legends and lore of our people. And then Wednesday evening, our Torah study, where we're reading the weekly Torah portion. We just started the Book of Numbers, Bamidbar, the journey of our people through the wilderness, from Mount Sinai to the Promised Land. And what's very special about this weekend in particular, though, on Sunday we have a chance for a joint study session to celebrate Shavuot, Hag HaShavuot, the Feast of Weeks. Seven weeks after Passover, we have a tradition of celebrating receiving the Torah, a harvest holiday that brought our people together thousands of years ago. And the way we celebrate it today is by staying up and studying. We're not going to stay up that late. We're going to be starting this year at Beth Shalom. Every year we go back and forth. Last year we hosted it online. This year they're hosting it live. And God willing, next year we'll host it live at Temple Beth Ami. But we'll join together at 7 p.m. for a brief evening service, followed by dessert, and a chance for us to study some texts together. It's a Jewish tradition that people do across the country, around the world. And so we wish you a Hag Sameach in addition to Good Shabbos tonight. We hope that the next few days will bring peace to us, to Israel, indeed to the whole world. Good Shabbos.